Hello, friends. So I know I'm not the only one that is always bombarded with ads on Instagram and other social media, but are you also goofy enough to buy something? God, I hope so. Yeah, they have to be, right? Because they're not, they're not only marketing to me. Halara, Halara, right? And it's usually athletic wear. They usually advertise me athletic wear and dress with shorts or biker shorts underneath or sewn in and they're always tempting. But this time got me. This time. I've been thinking about it for maybe two weeks before I was like, just buy it. Just buy it. And then really, why buy one when you can buy two? <laughs> I bought two overalls from them. It just, it came in the mail. I'm gonna cover that up so I don't tell everybody where I live. But it came in the mail yesterday and I'm like, let's open it. Let's open it. They come individually bagged. That's nice. So the deal when I bought them, they were two for $50? Yeah, I think they were two for $50. I was like, that's not bad. And really, it was the pink. It was the pink. Ah! All right, I'm gonna go try this on. I'm actually very concerned by like just doing this and looking down to my feet. It looks like this length is crazy. All right, I'll be right back. <laughs> so obviously you can't just have overalls and just be like wearing overalls without a shirt. So I went to TJ Maxx. Ooh. And got me a two pack. Cause how fitting is that? Wear the white one with the pink and then I'll wear the peachy orangey creamsicle one with the black to brighten it up and so cute they're so cute but really what I'm really kind of excited for and I just I couldn't help myself I saw it I was in awe that they were there and that there were a couple of them there and I was like you don't need to get two of the same one <laughs> don't do that but hold on urban decay naked palette like my whole brain exploded these are $50 palettes this one I think was 25 this one was marked down to 20 I was like what how are these here how are these here they were locked up in a box and the person did have to you know when I checked out she had to take them out of the box <sighs> I can't even tell you. I'm so excited. I'm so excited for this. <laughs> oh, they're so cute. Oh, and they're so pretty. It's so pretty. It's so pretty. Oh my God. <laughs> so this is one. I'm gonna be honest with you. I do like the silver. I'll have to, I'll have to play with it a little bit and put a face on because I think I got Wild West is the one that I bought for $50 full price full value when it came out oh my god I can't I can't even begin I can't even begin like the overalls so nice super comfy looking soft but this this made my whole brain explode that this was there I bought this whole, like, the shirts and these two palettes for $60. When, like I said, I bought the other one. Oh, she's gorge. Oh, don't look into the mirror. The apartment might be messy. <laughs> yeah, so anyway, just an FYI, a certain influencer did a video about how, like, you can buy expired and used makeup at discount stores and I don't want to get sued so we're just gonna call them discount stores call them by their name call them by their name you have evidence you're confident in saying it and say it say it 
No, it's, it's biased reporting is what he was doing. He knows that if you buy, you know, his palette, this is, this isn't his, it's, I've never bought anything from him and whatever. If you, if you like their products, that's fine. I'm just <sighs> urban decay all the way. She was my first grown up makeup. <laughs> Halara did make some very comfortable overalls. I would say the pink are great. I put on the pink first and they were very baggy. Let's begin. I would rather have something a little baggier than maybe a little tighter. When I put on the black ones, however, so it was actually a little bit smaller. When I put on the pink ones, I thought, well, maybe I should just get a large because of how baggy it is. I don't like the shirts from TJ Maxx, and that makes me sad. They're kind of like belly shirts. Now I have them on. I thought you can see it, but it still makes me uncomfortable. I don't like it. I don't like it. It's a skin tight belly shirt. That's gross. <laughs> okay, so final thoughts. These are super comfortable. They're nice to lounge around in and they look somewhat presentable. They definitely look better than sweatpants and you just definitely feel nicer when wearing them. So I work from home and then one day I wore the black ones instead of my usual sweatpants. <laughs> and I still felt super comfortable as well as felt that I looked nice. And it was just one of those days where I really did need a boost because I had zero energy. So sometimes dressing up does make you feel better. And this didn't sacrifice comfort. So I would recommend this in regards to loungewear. Also, I did this as a joke just to hold it, but look how deep this pocket is. This is very nice. Hold on, ready? <gasps> These are good too. These are really good pockets on the side. There is a little pocket on the butt. <laughs> now, the only thing that I will say is I did not like the actual length. Um, I might learn how to hem to get that fixed. <laughs> And I also didn't like that they're both an XL, but very obviously the pink one is a lot bigger than the black one. Go bigger, just be safe, and learn to alter your clothes. <laughs> Alright friends, love you. Have a good day. On to the next look. I'm not gonna pronounce this right because I don't even know how it's spelled, but it's like Heljara? No, there's no J. I look like a broken doll. <laughs> Stupid. I regret doing this lipstick with these eyes, but it's fine. Whatever, who cares? He wanted you to stop buying his product, not this, these are mine. I don't have sensitive skin, I'm just old. <laughs>